Hello, Bumpy McSquiggums here, and I am going to continue with the Weekly Runs series. This is Week 7, Steam Marines. Yes, we've had two previous episodes, that makes this Episode 3. And we are going to continue where we left off with our leader-filled, well, run, I suppose. So this should look very, very familiar. And let's see what happens. Alright, well, he's going over there for some unbeknownst reason. I know that's not exactly the proper context, but it's okay. Does our Grenadier have bullets? He does, and he is going to utilize those bullets right now to eliminate a Zeshret. Zeshret. I don't know. I don't know what a Shret is, but if it was a threat, well, I should probably learn to speak. Alright, charge or take less damage? We're going to take less damage simply because, well, we want to. Okay, well, as it stands right of this a moment in time, well, everybody has uh, some bulatios. It does appear that they do. Wow, that's a lot of bad guys. All right, so we're going to end our turn again. Uh, no, 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 I don't think we are, actually. We are going to use our ammo crate. There we go. So we will be ready for the next wave of enemies that come to, well, die horribly right there. And we're going into guard mode right there with them. So we're going to come down here, take a look in this room. There's going to be nothing there. Which essentially means that we are right as rain. We are golden, as they say. Not entirely sure who exactly says that, but I assume someone does somewhere. Some way, somehow. Alright. So he moves a little bit. He moves a little bit. And he done got shot. Alright, so what I believe I'm going to do is move here. Take a blast at him. Hmm... I think I'm going to move here, and I'm fairly certain I'm going to go into guard mode. And I might as well go into guard mode there with him, and we will loot this, get some more credits. Hopefully we do eventually find a vendor to use. Oh no! There's a bad guy coming to kill me. Perfect. Ah, oh, this couldn't have gone better. Alright, maybe it could have gone slightly better. Alright, well, we're going to start with our Grenadier because, well, we want people to suffer horribly at our hands. So we're going to blast him. He's still in range. Down he goes. Perfect. Let's see, what is this guy's range? He's the two, isn't he? He is the two. Well, that is unfortunate. And he is the four, so they're still very, very much in range. So what I believe we're going to do is fall back. And with that ride have him fall back. Hopefully he survives. And just to get rid of some of the extra stuff we got laying around. Boom. There we go. And uh, we'll go in guard mode. Why not? Alright, we'll end that turn. See what happens. A little flaming robot vacuum cleaner is coming up. Or the flame bot vacuum cleaner as I like to call it. And I took a pot shot at it. And one, two, three, there we go, he's in range there, and down he goes. Well, let's get this guy a little bit closer to the Acton. So I, I will be able to take a shot there. Let's see, what's his range? Uh, one, two, three, I need four, and his range is three. Well, that sucks. Or does it? Nope, it doesn't. Okay. 
Well, it looks like we've cleared that room. So in reality, all we have left to do is clear this room up over here, and we will be done with this floor, I think. Well, it looks like there's some more area up here. So maybe I'm jumping the gun a little bit, and we know what happened last time I jumped the gun. I lost both my scout and my support class character. Um, both of those were not good things. Alright, well, he is in range. And he is no longer alive, which is fantastic. I'm going to put him in guard mode there. Oops, we will hit the wrong button there. Waste a little spot of ammo. NBD. No big deal. Let's see if this robot comes to play. He did, and he died for it. So... Oh no, there are many tangos in sight. Well... Looks like one of our guys got an upgrade from Private First Class to Lance Corporal. I like it. Shots reduce... I think I'm going to have one of our guys, and this is going to be the four guys, going to shoot all enemies in range. I think that is going to be a very, very nice ability. Oh, we have no bullets. No bulatos. Well, that could be problematic. Alright, so we're going to wait this turn out and see what happens. It's not so bad. Alright, we're going to get him to go down, take a shot. I'm going to fire on the enemy. Fire on the enemy! Might as well use some of these grenades. I mean, we have them. Boom. Alright. So that means this guy right here. Uh, he's got one shot. Might as well utilize it and fall back. And yeah, we'll sit here and wait. And I guess we'll move this guy down here? Sure. Well, in the turn, I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing, guys. I have a lot of shotgunners. My grenadiers grenadierizing things. It's better than grenadierizing things, I suppose. And we're going to go into guard mode. Totally intentionally, I might add. It's Q and Z, guys. And I hate to admit it, but apparently I get confused between Q and Z. go. Alright, so what we need now is a miracle. And we found our miracle. There we go. Alright, so it appears that there are very few enemies left, if any. And we're going to use the mana box. And it essentially gave me more bullets. Bullets. We got more bullets. I know. You gotta, you gotta say it really flat. Non-combatant body count is piling up. Damn. Alright, well... I suppose he can come break the wall over here. Gamma rays strike. Animal regains health, but is sterilized. What? Well, we have a sterilized animal now. Ironically, I think he's the only one who didn't actually need to be healed, but that's okay. Now that is all right. I don't think I actually looted that. There we go. Alright, we'll go onward toward the elevator. We'll break through the wall. And we will end the turn. Apparently there's more than meets the eye. It's a waste of a laser shot. So apparently the pictures are random items if you pick them up. They could do just about anything. They could even be a boat. You know how much we've wanted one of those. Wait, that has nothing to do with this game. Sorry. It's funny nonetheless. Alright, let's see here. 
get him up and facing. We will end the. Actually, I think it just double ended the turn, which is kind of funny. All right, let's see what's behind uh, this door. Two pictures. Which basically means that we are going to head back toward the elevator. Simply because we can. All right. He's in range. So he's this guy. He's going to be sucked out into the vacuum of space. No, no, he's not. All right, we'll move down. End our turn. We need this guy to get more AP. Let's see, it takes forever to get around. And down we go, guys. Victory is ours. Now, normal progress report, I have no idea. I don't, I guess I don't have any idea what this means. Maybe it's we took too long, I'm not sure. But, we are on the fifth level now, we have passed four. And it should be a new record for us. Alright, command deck level five. Alright, so let's see here. We will move over here, break that open. Break that open as well, go through this door, and there are no enemies anywhere around. We'll break that open. We will use the computer terminal when we're actually capable of doing so. And we're not going to guard with him because that is a dangerous proposition. There's a robot above us. We were wise to guard. We shall go down and we shall not explode yet. We're going to fire once. Then we're going to move forward. And... Mm, I guess that's okay. And what is his position? He is the two. He's always of the two. He just never seems to be in the right position, does he? We have no rounds with this guy. Well, that's unfortunate. We only have one round with him. So, one, two... If we move back... And we guard, he should come at us and die for it. Likewise, he needs to get out of dodge. And guard. Alright. I think that is what we need to do. We will see. Maybe we can get shot. Uh, he needs to reload. He's got two uh, bullets left. And we have a grenade that we're going to utilize for killing purposes. Reload him. Guy's got good range. Take that guy down. Utilize the computer in the next turn. Which leaves our buddy animal here. Hey, we found yet another enemy. We'll put him in guard mode and, well, we'll leave it at that. Alright. Now, what I'd like to do is select this guy and use the canteen because, well, He's considered he has nothing. Survivors are directed to bunker in the deck elevators. We'll shoot him, and then we will actually fall back. And we have no bullets with this guy, but we do have more grenades that we need to get rid of. Alright, and this guy has earned a promotion. He is now a Lance Corporal as well. And there we go. And at this point... Um, I suppose I could come over here and just take a peek at what's going on. Oh no! Apparently there's a boss! Run away, little... Person, guy, marine, dude, leader. Well, 
I was definitely curious as to whether or not there were bosses in this game. Well, I guess I have my answer. Meteor shards. Robot enemies on this level gain plus one armor. Crap. And now we have the danger music, so that definitely helps. Alright, so we're going to actually move down to Corporal rank. The ranks seem a little weird. Isn't a Lance Corporal higher than a Corporal? I don't, I don't know. Alright. A blade of armor reduces all non-physical damage by 25%. Or, Pincer. A melee attack that reduces armor by one. No, we're going to go with this one. Okay, so... need to get over by the other marines and hope we can take that guy down. to end our turn. Let's see. Feel relatively safe over here. Relative being the optimal turn. Uh, term, rather, sorry. Good old Steady is the four shotter. He can move four spaces. I'm not sure if he's melee only. We don't know anything about the Hulk. Looks like he can fire up to three spaces away, so that is going to be a problem. I don't actually want to break that down this turn, so we will wait here. We'll end our turn, see what happens. And he's got a lot of health, 120. That's amazingly high. Alright, we're going to retreat away from this because the Hulk has moved. And it looks like he's trying to isolate our, our boy animal down there. We're going to wait it out. We're going to play very passively and cautiously for this little bit here. Roda, robot enemies on this level gain plus three armor. Well, fantastic, because, you know, we needed them to have even more armor than they already had. I believe the longer this goes, the more random bull crappedness is going to happen to us here. Alright, so it looks like he wants to go at us. Alright, well we will take a shot. And then we will take another shot and miss. And down he goes. Well, we'll see what happens. I'm going to guard mode with him and hope and pray that something good comes out of all this. He does seem to have uh, left. I think something terrible is about to happen. Maybe we can just blow him up in one turn and survive, hopefully. We'll find out. Here he comes. And I slowed him down. And I don't know what just happened, but we're not dead. And I am very, very happy about this not being dead thing. We don't know what the mana boxes do. Alright, so we're going to just blast him straight up with grenadage. Anything that does extra... Nope. Alright. Let's see what happens. Here we go, guys. We did zero damage. Hmm. One damage. Oh, boy. 
That uh, random, <coughs> random generated bullcrap is going to be the death of us. Or we can do that and be amazing. Totally planned. Totally planned that. That's why I am a genius and everybody else is inferior to me in all ways. That's right. Visit Pixie's bo Boutique on the engineering deck. Look at that. That boss didn't stand a chance. Look at him. He'll just sit down there in space like, Oh no, I done got beat. The Marines are too strong. That's right. Genius. Absolute genius. There's really nothing else to say about that. <clears throat> yeah, we got lucky. We got really lucky. Really, 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 really lucky. Alright, well, we'll end the turn in there. We'll grab the credits, and we're done. We're hopping down to the next level, guys. Look at that. Victory! We're going onward. Current score. Turns taken. Levels passed. Squad members' deaths, too. Yeah, survivors recruited. It's not so bad. We've killed 71 enemies. We've shot 183 times. We've used melee none. We've dealt a lot of damage, but we haven't taken that much damage. I think we're doing okay. And we've knocked two enemies into space. Huh. I don't know what this is. Alright, so we are... We did this. That's the bridge deck. The armory deck. The medical deck. The engineering deck. So we actually get a choice of where we want to go now. Not sure where we started at, but that's kind of cool. See, I've never made it this far, guys. So this this makes me pretty happy that I'm actually going to be able to give you guys a little bit more than, well, what I've gotten to thus far. Uh, like I said, I played it a few times, and, well, I didn't do so well. So we're going to go with the engineering deck, I guess. Alright, engineering deck level one. So, cool. Still have yet to find a vendor of sorts. <sighs> oh. Well. Hi. That's not good. Hmm. Who is this? It's a steady. Alright, good. I want him in guard mode. Well, let's see what happens, guys. Apparently there's a boss on the very first part of the next level. And we've kept him from murdering our souls, so that's good. Though I will admit I'm a little terrified right now. And I still have no bullets. That's unfortunate. So we'll, we'll do a little bit of a treat, cheap trick there. Hmm. I'm going to think this one through. Huh. I somehow got hurt. And I don't know why. Alright. Well, what I know what I need to do first is shoot him. Back. Oh boy. Well. Don't know what that did. Don't know what that did either. Well, um, I think we may end up losing this fight. Ah, a chest appeared. Fantastic. Two chests appeared, apparently. And, well, let's see what happens, guys. I have a feeling this is going to be pretty terrible. This guy seems very nasty. Oh no, don't come through the door, don't come through the door. Oh, okay. Huh. Okay. 
We're still alive. As scary as that is. Boy, it sure doesn't seem like we do much damage to this guy, does it? Oh, man. What do we do here? I think what we do here is this. We're going to utilize our restore all action points, and we are going to maybe take him out. Um, all right, I gotta see what this guy actually has. Does he have the remove AP thing? Doesn't look like it actually. Oops, sorry guys. It takes a screenshot anytime I hit escape, so yeah, that happened. It'll turn. What does this do? I don't care about that. Sweet. I guess moving him back has removed all his AP. And also sets him up for a missed explosion. But we're going to be able to reload him. And we're still alive! Not sure for how long, but we're still alive! I will admit I'm quite terrified right now, still. We've done it. We've achieved total victory. Sarge would have loved that. Alright, total victory is not true. But we are still alive. And one of our original guys is pretty hurt, so we will use that. Now what is it? What is this exactly? Hulk suit. It looks heavy. <gasps> no way! Look at me! I'm in a Hulk suit! Like a boss. I don't know what that did to me. Oh wow, it gave me a giant boost in hit points. Well, look at me now. Alright, that's pretty darn cool. Kudos to you, worthless bums. That is awesome. That alone made this game amazing. On top of everything else that made this game amazing. Ooh, what is that? He's got three movements. Oh no, he can shoot. Oh boy. And you have the crappiest range alive. Well, fantastic. Hmm. Question is, do I want to... Oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Alright, well, we're gonna go into guard mode here, and we'll see. Chances are we're gonna lose one of our guys. <gasps> Maybe not. He might have just blocked his boy. Nope, he did not block his boy, but his boy didn't seem to do a whole lot of damage, actually. And hindsight being what it is, I probably shouldn't have put the Grenadier as my awesome dude. Alright, this guy's got three. Yeah, he's got three, so we're gonna move him up. That guy back. This guy forward. Hit him one more time. We have no ammo left, so we're gonna lob a grenade. And we're gonna move up. I would have loved to have reloaded, but. And our weapon is dry as well. Well, poo. Maybe this is gonna be enough. Of course not. Well, let's see what we can actually make happen here. Oh! 
Okay, so that changes my attack somehow. Okay, well, that was unfortunate because I probably could have done something very useful there. And he's a two shotter. Oh boy. Well, we done messed up. And of course he doesn't have any bullets. Why would he have bullets? That just makes too much sense, right? Ah, oh boy. Alright. Well, I'm pretty sure this guy's going down unless he's got some, like, a magical, amazing dodge abilities. But I'm pretty sure he doesn't, so he's gonna die. But I will say with a large amount of certainty, it's still pretty cool to have that giant robot thing. Wow, it's actually tanky, too. No, Animal was nowhere near retirement. Shame on you. How could you do such a thing? Cool. Knock, knock. Who's there? Death! Tee-hee. <laughs> Alright. One, two... No. So we're gonna hide behind him. Looks like these things are going to attempt to do some damage to our amazing suited up bad boy. But nothing happening. Enemy in range. It's funny, too, because his name is Machine. Neutralized. Alright. He's got no bullets, so he's going to go on a gathering expedition. And he's going to reload. And this guy is going to end the enemy. That's right. Down he goes. Well, this run is going quite a bit better than I would have ever hoped. So I feel pretty good about this. And I think we're going to have to end the episode relatively soon, too, guys. Which kind of makes me a little sad. Things have been going so well, too. But it looks like, uh, well... There may be more to this game than originally, uh, considered. Oh, so you use all your remaining AP when you fire with this guy. Alright, well that's good to know. Because I, in fact, did not know that. So you learn something new every time, I suppose. And move him up. Put him in guard mode as the giant robot of death. I like it. Oh no! Say goodbye! Breaking through walls trying to kill me? What in the world were you thinking, fool? I pity the fool! Me and Mr. T both pity the fool. Guard mode yet again, and we'll end our turn. It seems like somebody might want to actually fight me. Oh, this is gonna be pretty beautiful. Alright, Particle Bombardment, Machine... Oh, see, that's not all that fantastic, due to the fact that, yeah, he gets more, that's, that's great, but... He uses all his action points in one turn. Kind of sucks. Yep, that's what I thought was going to happen. Ooh. There we go. End our turn, see what happens. Oh, we took one additional damage. Well, that is unfortunate. Oh, no. Oh, that thing hurt me. Well. That's probably not good. Also, it looks like my keyboard has stopped. Uh... Yes. Alright, hold on, guys. Sorry about this. But whenever my keyboard stops registering, well, you got to do some stuff. Still in range, really? Yeah, but I have no AP left. And it does not appear that I'm going to be able to get past my buddy here. So 
So what we're going to do is fire into the hole. Let's see what happens now. Oh no! Oh! Oh no! Well, from the front it's nearly indestructible. From the back, not so much. Well, that was really, really unfortunate. I think that well, you would think that would be it, but apparently not. Oh, look, another robot. Fantastic. Alright, well, we'll get into position. Apparently there's a room over there somehow. And we are going to go right here. At the turn, he won't be able to break through the wall yet. Which is good news for me. Which of these two? He's the two, so we're gonna go with him first. And we're empty. Fantastic. And we're going to reload. And boom. That should be it. I don't think there's any more aliens playing around. I certainly hope not. Alright, we're going to make our way back toward the elevator. If we can. There we are. Break through that. Get down. And when this guy makes it over to the elevator, we will call an end to this episode, guys. So thank you for joining me. This has been week 7 of the weekly runs. This has been episode 3. The game is Steam Marines by Worthless Bums. It is a fantastic, fun little squad-like, turn-based, roguelike type dealy. So, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, do all that fun stuff, and please share. And I guess I will have to see you guys next time. So until then, Bumpy McSquiggums, over and out. <laughs>